What's up, people? Afro Blade Master here for essentially a reboot of my Skyrim Let's Play because, well, it's it would probably be much easier just to record it on PC, even though it'll be going at like between like four and fifteen frames a second, which uh, is probably going to really bug. This might bug me in uh, editing, but I'm not sure. And first, we gotta pick what race we're gonna be. Eh. Like, I think this time you're going to be an Argonian, uh, Khajiit, or Lykitos? A Lykitos? I'm not sure. Basically like a wolf girl. I think they're more, like, based on like the available hairstyles and stuff, I think they're more based off of Khajiit than, the other, than any other race. Uh, like, they are pretty good, and they start out with more, with like 150 health, stamina, and magicka, but their carry weight is like 100 less than all the other races. Uh... I think I'll go with Argonian because I really like their race ability. <clears throat> okay, so this part will just okay, like um, I actually just made I actually just like made a like a Khajiit recently, not Khajiit Argonian recently. Uh, I think I'll have her be like. I don't know what color I want her to be. Well, let's click on this. That. It's not actually changing anything. Oh, there we go. I can be like bright fucking purple. Let's make it a little bit, let's make it like just fade a bit more, make it a bit like make it, mm, change saturation a bit. Make it a bit make it a little bit darker, I guess. Or I could just be like pitch black. But that but that wouldn't be much fun now, would it? Uh I think it's gonna take ages. No, I actually, I guess, kind of want to be red, but not like that red. Like, mm. maybe like this red. I kind of like this red. Okay, so let's save the color and accept. Okay, wait. Uh, max. I don't miss any of the other options. Complexion like that. Scars actually show up more than I thought they would. Act. <laughs> let's do that scar. Warping. Let's do. What's the opposite around the color wheel? I can't remember. I think it's like yellow. Yellow or green? I think it's green. Oh, wait, no, that's just like. Wait, no, it's not. What the? What is that one? Oh, it's like the dot right there, and there's like. And this one's like just marks on the neck. Like, why, is that, why is that side for face green, though? Oh, that's weird. I was gonna make like a dark green. Nose type. Yeah, this will be like sped up. Uh, let's just make that put it down a little bit. Change like the wider nose. Nose length. Let's actually pull it out a bit. Jaw width. Eh, that should be good. Jaw height. Bring that up a little. Not too much. And eh, jaw forward is good. Cheekbone height. Let's make, let's make it a little. Like tuck it in a tiny bit. Let's make the, let's make all these like that dark. Let's see what all these look like as that darker green too. And let's actually leave that one. Actually, I'll leave the neck normal. I kind of like that. <coughs> Upper eye shape. Eye color. Let's make. Eh, I don't. I don't want to make her blind. I don't want to do that one either because that just looks messed up. Kind of like that one. Uh, my height is good. Let's try to. I think let's put the eye, eye width in like that a bit. That's not much of the depth. My liner, let's make that like, like dark green as well. Should I also make it darker red and tint a darker red? Nice. Brown type. Yeah, I'll make it like that. Actually, no, I'll just remove that. Let's make it type 1. Mm, that should be good. Mouth type. Mouth type, that one's good. Uh, height and with uh, chin width, let's kind of bring that a bit. Make chin a little bit smaller too, so it's like not like a brick. So it's not just like a brick on her mouth. And that forward is good. Lip color, let's let's make that let's make that like that red too. Hmm. I always thought the feathers look weird. And I forgot I had a 
the hair manga as an afro. So I kind of like this one. I kind of like the two horns of the cloth kind of put on him. Okay, here's our new Argonian. Okay, quickly just hit F5 to save the priest, save the slot because it likes to crash sometimes. And let's, and let's name her. Hmm. She's, she's going to be more of a tank because, because as I said, I'm essentially like going to redo the... Sorry, I had to take a drink real quick. I'm basically going to redo the last like three episodes I did. So like those, so, like basically those are just I'm gonna pretty much repeat those. I think I'm just gonna leave them up just in case I ever get like a better capture card and can't play PC Skyrim f for whatever reason. I'm also probably gonna go back, and this is also probably gonna be one of those update whenever series like everything else on my channel. <laughs> but this one might, but this one's probably gonna be like, okay, like it, like I'll probably just play this for a few hours one day then. Like make that as its own thing and <clears throat> just record me playing this for a few hours one day and just like record just like upload those videos whenever whenever I feel like just between other things. If I actually ever get back up into ever I, if I ever actually get back into uploading stuff, which by the way I have actually recorded like a total of, like five hours of like Minecraft stuff, but I deleted all of those because one, a few of them were just straight up practice and two throughout most of them I was literally just rambling and tripping over my words constantly okay so she's going to be more of a tank and I want her to have like an Argonian tank like tanky name No, nah, that's stupid. Eh, I guess that'll do. Swings big sword. Cause she's gonna be like a two-handed warrior who uses like great swords. I'm actually making like a great like a sword swinging motion. <laughs> it'll do. <coughs> Hold on. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Had to mute my mic for a second because... Yeah. Okay, but first, before I do anything, let's configure some mods. Okay, first off, the Soul Gem. Uh, let's kick off that. Click that and click that and turn the scale down to 50%. I actually like doing, I actually do a lot of enchanting in this game, so yeah. Okay, this one, turn that down to 25. Third person. Uh, turn that off. Mm, I should be good for that. Um... Yeah, I have a lot of freaking things <laughs> on here. Let's go to Sky UI. Uh, mm -hmm. General. Category Icon Theme. Celtic. Yeah, font size. Medium. That'll, that'll do. Uh, disable Icon Colors. Show button help. Mm. Hmm. That could be useful, but nah. A uh, HUD icon, let's just make those uh, HUD icons small. Okay, I should be good for that. And one last one, a matter of time. Display. In-game clock. Um, wait, hold on. General. Let's 
Let's make it picture of day. Clock type 12 hours, yeah, that'll do. Uh, yeah, that'll do it for the prefer pre. Oh, wait, no. And I just heard fucking Facebook go off. What the hell? Rain gear disabled. I keep forgetting to uninstall this mod. Uh, cold gear disabled. There we go. Mm, there we go. Now meet our meet the new drag meet our newest dragonborn. Swings big sword. Okay. Approach my child. I'm not gonna do the choose where your new life shall begin. I'm not gonna do the vanilla opening. Which would be I got caught crossing the border illegally. Instead, let's do uh, attacked and left for dead. The light of hope shines even for you. Don't give up. Okay, now what this? Okay, now this is an. I I think this mod is called alternate start or something like that. Basically, the star I just pick. What that one will do is it'll just spawn me randomly in one of several like locations just out in the middle of some out in the middle of nowhere, Tamriel. Okay, I'm here. Let's take the horse meat. Uh, let's check the map. Map. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, as you can tell, I have a buttload of mods installed. I did not mean to do that. Remove it. Mm. Helgen's all the way over here, and that's where we gotta go. Huh. Okay, then. Let's just start walking to Helgen. <laughs> uh, I believe it was west. And since direct west is like a just a cliff face, let's just go this way. Yeah, like... Okay, if you guys like, just like, just just to tell you guys, if you guys like want or want to recommend a mod, just go ahead and recommend. I'll like I'll like look into it, see if it's one that'll actually like help out or if it'll even freaking work. Oh, staff of sparks, I'll take that. And glass arrow too. That's actually pretty good. Uh, not gonna use archery, but okay. <laughs> Free experience. Okay. Um. But yeah. Like. I'll, like, I'll mostly take, like, if I'm gonna do any mods, it's gonna be, like, armor mods. So, if you guys want me to do an armor mod, just make sure it's for the CBBE body, because that's the body I use. Because, 7 base is cool and all, but, like, I, like, like, a lot of those armors like to glitch out on me, and same with UNP, actually. Uh, oh, pickaxe. Yeah, I have a mod that makes like unread books glow and like like the color they glow like tell you what type of book they are. Ooh, a, something happened here. But like, yeah, like like um like red books are like skill books. I think like green ones are spell books and blue ones are the other type and hello there wolf. Let me beat you up. Come on, you freaking... I'll beat you up. I always found it annoying that a wolf, like, a lot of wolves just, like, start running, like, running around you. You know, let's just place a... Place some marker there. That way, it's just easier for me to tell which way I gotta go. Oh no, it was east. Huh. Yet sometimes I get like east, west, left, right confused. It's weird, I know. No one's perfect. Then again, I've never claimed to be anything close to perfect. Whatever. Let's just <laughs> let's just run the freaking Helgen. Butterfly. Come here. Come here, you bastard. There you go. Got it. Pretty sure I got it anyway. Yep. Two butter two blue butterfly wings added. <clears throat> How come 
every time I record, I suddenly get like a bunch of phlegm in my throat. I have to clear my throat every 12 flipping seconds. Anyway, um, what was I gonna say? Um. Okay, one thing that will probably happen once or twice. I know that's not what I. That's not what I was trying to. No, I wasn't gonna say. Oh, crap, Spriggan. Freaking. Freaking hate fighting Spriggans. At least when I don't have any weapons or armor. Ready your, ready your fists. Oh, okay, running away, running away, and dead. Is ah first death of the game. Thanks to a freaking spriggan. Sigh. Okay, so I'm back here again. Let's just, like grab that staff, arrow, and like, like freaking book again. I don't see the arrow this time. Let's switch to first person. Nope, I don't see it. Oh, at least we get a bunch of white caps. It's like a you know, little fairy circle there. As they're picking up all the mushrooms. And what's this? Oh, it's a shrine. A shrine to Akatosh. A couple dragon's tongue. A book that increases my enchanting. And Olaf and the dragon. I'm pretty sure that book has to do with like Dragon's Reach and like uh. Huzzah! I died again. Sigh. <laughs> this is gonna be one hell of a playthrough, isn't it? If this freaking beginning has anything to say about it, so let's grab all. Let's just. Harvest all these white, all this white cap for the billionth time. Okay, now I have, I actually have a um, like one of the mods I have, which you might have noticed it when I was messing around with the menus. Like one of the mods I have is called Achieve That, and basically just adds a bunch of little achievements in the game that'll get you points for. Various thing that you can like spend on various little bonuses like like the cheapest one is increased carry weight. The most expensive one is a full set of Daedric armor. <clears throat> but I mostly just save up and go for the extra perk points. Like I could also increase my health, magic, and stamina. I could increase my damage output by like a certain percent, like a small percent. Um, actually, you know what? Let's just go to the menu and just just show ya. And carry weight, health, magic, stamina, magic and stamina regain, elemental resistance, speed, random skill gets one level, shout recovery, 5%, all damage, 5%, perk point, and Daedric armor set. I mostly go for the perk points. Yeah, like these, these like little things, like, like how much total money you have, so like not money on hand. Um... Diseases, which is going to be difficult since our Gonians are resistant to diseases. Number of side quests, number of main quests, like story quests. Um, clear dungeons, slay dragons. Like specific number of horses, like buy horses. Um, loot chests, steal horses, discover locations, etc., etc., etc. But like, okay, one of the things I'm going to be trying to do is, um, let's see, where are ya? Oh, I'll just tell you, like, 
two of the specific, like, there's going to be one, there's going to be a couple specific achievements I'm going to be going for. Since I did this, since I like picked this opening, like I'm not, I'm not going to be going for the get level 10 in two days one. Because I actually want to go for the, um, freaking wolves. Because, like, I'm not going to be going for the get level 5 in two days one. But I will be going for the kill, not level 5, level 10. But I will be going for the kill a dragon, the kill a dragon before level 5. So, like, I will be trying to, um... So we'll be trying to get through like Bleak Falls Borrow and all that stuff, like with with, with being level four or less. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, I had to cough there. I'll be honest, um, like I think another like another achievement I'm going to be trying to go for is called Say No to Alchemy. Which is get to level 25 without using with using less than five potions, and that was gonna be kind of difficult. It's gonna be slightly easier since I'm Argonian and I have the like the, the race skill to heal up myself and <gasps> stupid necromancers. Okay, let's uh, just. Can do. Activate Heath skin. So I actually heal Going to <laughs> faster than they you. can kill me. But that's my one use of that skill for the day. No oh no, you're you're not gonna freaking be getting off that easy. Okay then, that takes care of them. Uh, you hold on, let's uh. You know what? Let like let's uh just to change the look a little bit. Let's switch into that outfit. There we go. But yeah, as I said, if you guys want to recommend any specific like armors to me, like this, like, just keep in mind this character is going to be using heavy armor. Like like I'll like if if you guys like show me a good armor, I'll I'll like I'll, I'll at least put it on and show it off for you guys. Like, yeah, like, like, if, um, you guys want to recommend specific armors to me, please just make sure they're CBBE. And please, may, and please have them be either from the, from the Nexus or the, um, freaking, what's it called? The Steam Workshop. One of those two. And wow, we're, like, we're going at, like, 10 FPS. I, like, it's kind of stuttery. <laughs> Like I have the I have like the texture quality down at medium, but I have the draw distance a bit higher, so things don't like pop up out of freaking nowhere, which is really annoying when you're, cause, which is really annoying for a couple of my characters, cause like specifically my assassin and my like my Argonian assassin walks softly, and my Khajiit mage soul, like they're ranged characters, so having a character not show up unless they're like. 10 feet in front of you, it's kind of annoying. Well, I'm not going to be using, like, the only magic I'm probably going to be using is healing if I, is healing since I'm not going to be using any potions. Actually, you know, let's, um, let's go, let's go into this town and see if I can at least buy a weapon. Though I'm not exactly hundred, though I'm not really familiar with this town too much because I've only gone here a couple times. Uh, but according to this sign, this is the blacksmith's house. So let's see if he's out working on his stuff. Yes, he is. He got a Steel's good, he got a two-handed sword for me. I'm loyal to Den Gear first. Hmm. Blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Yeah, I know how to barter. Uh, and I gotta... You know what? Let's just take the steel greatsword. 
And, like, uh, I'll sell the horse hide too. Yeah, my okay, I now have a great sword. That's. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of butt clipping this freaking series in there. Oh, I I think I can hand I think I could handle that. <laughs> Not sure about Try you guys. There's also gonna be a lot of there's, lot of, there's also gonna be a lot of freaking tail clipping too. So, yeah, hope you got hope you guys don't mind that too much. Like I try not to let it bug me, but it does sometimes. Like I remember a long time ago. Um, I oh oh yeah, you can guys can recommend like weapon mods too. That that'd be nice. Like a well, like a long time ago, I got a Buster Sword mod, and I was using a and like my two-handed warrior at the time was a Khajiit. I say at the time because I am constantly remaking my characters for one reason or another. Heck, in fact, I was lately like Skyrim has been bit sluggish, like, well, more sluggish than usual, but, um, like, Skyrim has been a bit off lately, because, like, it would, because, like, it, I think I removed the mod that, the mods that were doing this, but it would randomly just stop loading for, it actually just, like, stop and pause for, like, a good, like, like, half a minute. I'm on a pilgrimage to the Azura, the goddess of twilight. Well, hey, I can get that subquest now. In the mountains to the northeast, I'll mark it on your map. Yeah, go now. When I, now when I feel like it, I can go for the um for a danger quest, which I'll which I might do. Like, I honestly don't know what I'm going, what this series is going to be. I I don't know if it's just going to be me playing Skyrim as I normally play it, me just trying to do the main story quest, me just trying to do specific like specific side quests. If anything, it's probably just going to be me playing Skyrim as I play Skyrim. Which I'm all fine with. Okay, there's normally a bunch of bandits that live up here. Sorry, I'm like I pick e I pick every single freaking alchemy ingredient I can. You know, partly because like making potions is like free is like free um alchemy experience. Then you can sell them to make free bar for basically barter experience. But also there are achieve that achievements for like gathering certain numbers of ingredients eating certain numbers of ingredients oh wow the frame rate is really bad right now like okay okay I think it's we're at about 30 minutes I think I might um okay I think I'm gonna cut this here mess around with the options then probably um then boot it back up and see if it's any better okay uh, okay so next time on Skyrim we're going to be making we're gonna be getting to Helgen we're really close now All right I'll see you guys then this is Afro Blademaster logging off